Monkey's best of 2023. Let's get straight into it. Wait, wait. No. I think this is the first year in all my time doing these where almost every game on this list came out this year. That's oh, how damn. strong 2023 was for video games. Apparently it was quite strong game half of for games. Remakes. Yeah, wow, well, yeah, I hear right that Peter family from Peter. Fortnite, but me am on a different Peter level family. of video games knowing because mm -hmm. I know him from Feed a Peter. At first, I thought this game oh, was about clicking yeah, a jetpack Oh, yeah, I Peter, remember go this. Then you gotta go across the street to the gas station. To was this Roblox? Burgers. Then you hook up the computer to the Peter net. Then you gotta raise Joe's income. Then you gotta water the crops. And then you gotta get the gasoline so you can burn the vines to enter the cave so you can buy the $19 Fortnite card. <laughs> this is a very in-depth Peter game. Pizza. Pizza Tower reminds Pizza. me. Me like a nice pepperoni slice from Fredicini's. If you love chopping down the of neon white pizza towers, you really like this guy when it came out. The levels is like the crust, the music is like the sauce, and the mortar chicken is like the pizza bone that they put in the middle. If you're gonna make uh -huh, a Nintendo fan pizza game, bone. be smart that pizza tower and call the main character Barrio so you can make some money to buy some more pizzas with. Cocoon is the puzzle game for people who get angry at puzzle games. It's also a game that looks and sounds genuinely alien. I don't remember this game at all in the slightest. In a lot of my brain. Games, when you get stuck, it's because the game is being a dickhead. When you get stuck in Cocoon, <laughs> it's because you're a moron. I got stuck ah. like four times on. Mario RPG Only four has man's content genius. for a twenty-four hour game, and then jams all that material into a twelve-hour game. Resident Evil 4 is... I swear to God, if it's Super Mario Brothers 2 again, I'm gonna cry. This guy has... At least he has consistency if it is. The 7th and 13th Super Mario. Resident Evil game. Because we've seen so many action-packed Resident Evil now, Mario. this remake doesn't have the impact of the original. But in terms of execution, this game is just phenomenal. I even went for the 4-hour speedrun to unlock the chicken head and failed miserably. <laughs> but it was, you know, it was a fun 5 attempts or some shit. Creepy. Jesus. For Alan Wake 2, now there's two Alan Wakes. The one from... Fortnite oh, and the yeah. one from Alan Wake 1. In terms of combat, puzzles, enemy design, this game cannot go toe to toe with Resident Evil 4. But Resident Evil 4 doesn't have any musical numbers. Metroid True. Prime, I've tried to beat this game like 50 times. I don't. But I guess this. I don't like remakes, man. I know that it was a long time ago, but this game reminds me of Metal Gear Solid 2, where not only is it the best looking game on the console, I feel like but the it cash also runs at 60 FPS somehow. Truly, though, you played this game for the music. <laughs> is this Nintendo exclusive, isn't it? This year I played Samurai Yakuza, Spider-Man Yakuza, Yakuza 2, Yakuza 3, Yakuza 4, and Yakuza 6. So let That's me say, a lot of Yakuza. if you're going to play one of these, play Yakuza 0. But if you already played that one... Then play Yakuza 7. 2023 is probably the last okay. year I'll be able to beat a game this long again. So it's nice to have picked one where I didn't feel like a dumb fuck by the time I hit the end credits. There's too much combat, oh, sick. too much yapping, but there's also a lot of funniness. Video games need to be more funny. <laughs> games are getting too serious. True. We need more I, funniness I agree. out there in games. This game had like 100 funny parts, which is why this is one of the better RPGs you can Oh, let's play. go. With Mario, you always gotta wonder, what are they gonna do next? And with Mario Wonder, I was wondering Super how many wonder Mario. effects are they gonna do on this game, and they did a lot of them. And there was like three musical numbers, so Capcom is really gonna have to rethink Resident Evil 5 if they wanna stay competitive. Street Fighter 6 is fucking Dick. garbage. Everyone online plays like the littlest <laughs> bitch that's ever lived because- <laughs> Why did he choose it? This game is more defensive than Call of Duty. They only play two characters. JP is in this game, Dan is in this game, Hakan isn't in the game. The single player is for people who don't like fighting games. The arcade mode True. is depressing. There's no voice chat because this game is for cowards. The ranking system is super tedious. There's no unlockables. Everything is gated behind microtransactions, which are more like macro transactions. And the battle pass wow. for this game is worse than the battle pass from Halo Infinite. He's got 300, 300 hours? Only Nintendo would use the sequel to Breath of the Wild as an excuse to remake Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts. Low, In true. some respects, Tears of the Kingdom feels like a PS5 type sequel, where you're really just playing a better version of a game you already liked. On the other yeah. hand, this game is ridiculous. It does not make sense how a game this massive is also this polished. In this game, I built this thing, I built this, I built this, I said this. Heads up. I said this, good luck. <laughs>
The last game to let me play this creatively was Mario Odyssey and Breath of the Wild. Only <laughs> Nintendo would use the sequel to Pikmin 3 as an excuse to oh remake my Pikmin 2 God. with a dog. Of course Pikmin 4 is the game of the year. Did you really think Wait, there would be any other what? game here? Please, don't be dumb to me. This game is the game. Don't ever question uh, yeah. this. It's the most uh, relaxing game of the game. year and the most intense game of the year. I'm not Damn. even going to expound on it more than that. Revolutionary. Show me a game better than Pikmin 4. You can't. But the actual game of the year is Super Mario Bros. <laughs> Super Three? Mario. Huh? No, that's not on. He can't say that. It's two. It's always been two. Good video. Man is obviously delusional, but we love him still.